Late last Friday on July 6, 2012, President Barack Obama released his latest executive order. A 2200-plus word document offered as the assignment of national security and emergency preparedness communications functions. Although not widely publicized, these powers provide the President with complete control of all communication systems in America and is the most far-reaching yet of any of his executive decisions. The question is, why implement this totalitarian control system now? The President argues that it is necessary to reach anyone in the country during situations it considers critical, writing such communications must be possible under all circumstances to ensure national security, effectively manage emergencies and improve national resilience. What kind of threat or emergency is the President expecting in order to warrant a complete authoritative takeover of all communication systems and devices in America? Is he expecting an internet blackout? And what type of events would warrant the President flipping the off switch? Is he expecting another September 11th or perhaps a repeat of the May 6, 2010 stock market flash crash? What does the President know that we don't? And why would the government want to shut down our ability to communicate with each other in the event of a national emergency? On the government's official website for the national communication systems, the government explains that the infrastructure they now control includes wireline, wireless, satellite, cable, and broadcasting, as well as the transport networks that support the internet and other key information systems. This suggests that the President has indeed effectively just allowed himself to completely control the country's internet access. The President has put forth a plan to establish a high-level committee calling from agents within the Department of Homeland Security, the Pentagon, Federal Communication Commission, and other government divisions to ensure that his new executive order can and will be implemented. Is President Barack Obama expecting an attack on America? Why is he taking such careful consideration now in preparing this control grid? Does his latest executive order have anything to do with the National Defense Authorization Act, economic sanctions on Iran, fighting in Syria, or perhaps the 2012 Summer Olympics? Why now? And why has this largely been ignored by the mainstream media?